Hey everybody, how you doing? Hey, good evening, I'm Jake. I'm Joe, and this is the Stay at Home Dad Beer Cast Quick Review. That's right, and today we are going back to a old standard, something that is fantastic. A good We're going, standby. That's right, we're going to Rogue, and we have got the Double Chocolate Stout. Ooh. And while I have had so Ooh. many different Rogue beers, same. I haven't had this one. Nope. So I'm actually pretty excited. So, and it's brewed with natural flavors, it tells me. Mm -hmm. And it is coming in at 9%. And yeah. And I it's am. a year and a half old. Mm hmm. And they doubled down. Doubled everything. So, double everything's it. double. What do you want? Double it. Exactly. That's the rogue way. <laughs> double dead guy. Mm hmm. There's a lot of doubles. You make a valid point. So, with that though, let's shut up and drink. Cheers. Ooh, getting chocolate mm -hmm. on the nose, man. Whoa. Ooh. You get that, like, Whoa. milk chocolate leading yes. into a more of a bitter, bitter. chocolate. On the back. more yep. of that bitter coffee on the back end. That is a funky combo to get both of. Yeah, front end is very, very milk chocolate. Sweet. And then the bitter kicks at the back, and that's the finish. Wow. Interesting. It is it, it is making me think. Yeah, and I like that. No, I like 100%. it when a beer sit here sits here and makes me go. Oh. Yeah. Somebody tweaked okay. it a little bit and gave us something different. Exactly. So and yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is definitely a thinker. A thinker beer. Hmm. That bitter. Well, so I'm kind of grabbing something a little different every time I sip. I was just, the, the bitter has increased for me on the mm -hmm. third sip. Mm -hmm. And it's just, yeah. Yeah, it's getting into that like heavier dark cacao kind of flavor mm -hmm. sitting on the back end. Mm -hmm. um, that sweetness has minimized. Yeah, yeah. Um, but it's still there. There's definitely some mm -hmm. sweet milk chocolate flavors going, but it's falling oh. off for sure yeah but there is a lot of chocolate in this so oh, if yeah. you don't love chocolate <laughs> don't do drink it but why would you grab a can mm -hmm. oh, again we yeah. asked this but there's warning labels on stuff where mm -hmm. you don't think mm -hmm. there should be so here's our seriously weird warning it says chocolate on it don't buy it if you don't like chocolate yeah it's i mean it's, it's a chocolate beer if you love chocolate get packed. it you will be happy like yeah so yeah where are you sitting joe I mean, as a thinker, um, I'm sit right now. I might update it. I might update it later. Mm -hmm. Right now, I'm sitting at about a three-five. Yeah, right around there. Um, again, got a decent amount of a pour left to do, so that might change. Mm -hmm. But about a three-five. It's a little complex. It's interesting. It makes mm -hmm. you think. But it's a little heavy bitter on the back end for me with the stout. Yeah. It's mm -hmm. a little much. So yeah, three-five. Yeah, no, I'm kind of right there. I could drop it maybe a little even, but I'm not quite sure if it's a three, two, five. The, the, so it's got know. a good viscosity. It's got a good flavor yes. to it. Um, it's just heavy on chocolate, but yeah. I, I read that. And the bitter is building up mm -hmm. on the back end of me, and yeah. that's what might keep it at a three, mm -hmm. five. It's, it's, a yeah. bit, it's a bit bitter in the end. Yeah, so and it's, but yeah, that three, five minus. So there you go. Yeah, so. Cheers. Cheers. Have a good night, y'all.